As you can see, News Channel 5's Claire Kopsky is joining us here in the studio as we talk about businesses. And Amy, you're, you are so successful. I'm sure you had a business as a kid. For sure. Uh, no, I, I didn't. <laughs> we lemonade did do, stand something? No, I, I don't even think we did a lemonade stand. Yeah. Claire, I, I'm sorry. I, you did didn't? You? No. Well, I had a button bracelet business with a friend in grade oh, school. Oh, okay. And then my sisters and I did famously have a lemonade stand summer oh, after summer. Oh my gosh, my. we have a picture here. <gasps> I'm in the green with the apron. You know, we had oh, the oh cash goodness. register, but I think the thing that really drew people in was the brownies. Yes. You know, lemonade and brownies, oh, 50 yeah. cents. Perfect combo. I'm so proud of you. Quite the deal, right? Yeah. Well, there are some kids in town who are getting ready to show off their businesses. They are, and it's very, very impressive. They spent the summer preparing their first public children's business fair that's going to be hosted at Acton Academy. Take a look. The setup is official. We designed our logo, we created a brochure. And the dedication unmatched. My mission statement is to make beautiful and creative things and inspire others to do the same. These little entrepreneurs ranging from ages 6 to 14 have all started businesses. Um, this is Coke Sounds. Color splash cards. Dragonfly jewels. Sugar cane sushi. Each with a rational reason for beginning. Candy sushi. So like I like sushi and I like candy so it's a win-win. Do you ever have difficulties finding a suitable meal for to meet the needs of you and your family? It's just something really relaxing that everyone can enjoy and also Whenever you see the finished product, you're always really happy and you, like, you feel proud of like what you did. I like artwork and I wanted something that looked professional that was like a new form of art for me. Each business owner has been focused on preparing for Saturday's Children's Business Fair at Acton Academy. Everyone that will be selling at the business fair is under 14. For almost all of the 20 businesses, this will be their big debut. I just take one of my boxes, put it in there and then take one of my um, jellies and put it on there. Are you excited or were you nervous? Um, we're still like, we don't know the logistics of this business, so both. They're hammering out the details in hopes of selling out. We all worked really hard on this and uh, that we made it as perfect as we can. It's more than an A for effort on creations they hope their customers will treasure. I really hope people will come and I hope that some people will buy from me. In Nashville, Claire Kopsky, News Channel 5. So impressive. Well, the Children's Business Fair is this Saturday at Acton Academy in Nashville on Franklin Road from 1 to 4 p.m. There will be about 20 vendors from students from Acton Academy and other schools in the area.